Hey guys, so we're about to go to, where are you going, hun? Uh, to your ultrasound appointment. Yeah. So we're going to my ultrasound appointment and we're just trying to see um, if she's moved to the right spot because she's supposed to be in the middle and last time she was at the side. So we're gonna see if she's in the right spot now and we're going to go ahead and head out. This is my new car, by the way. If you guys want me to make a video, let me know. I just basically upgraded and got a 2020, so yeah. Your mask. We have to wear a mask in, uh, at, a, at this specific appointment. Yeah, you have to have a mask on because of COVID. So that's what's going on right now. Okay, guys, we're at Sonic now. Um, I got a cherry limeade and some mozzarella sticks, and Sam got the exact same thing as me, like he normally does. And yeah, I have 15 Not minutes really? to my appointment. Yes. I have 15 minutes to my appointment. I gotta stay in the car. <sighs> and he, yes, Sam has to stay in the car. Of course, there's no one allowed in your like checkup appointments and stuff. He can't come to any of my OB appoint OB checks, and he can't come to any of my ultrasounds. He, the only thing he can do is come in the room for the delivery. Ooh. That's all he can do. Okay, so I can't, I just got back from um, the ultrasound appointment and they said that she's, you know, in the right position. She just weighs a little bit too much. <laughs> so when the doctor came in, she was like, um, do you want me to, she was like, you're supposed to, she was like, you're supposed to be, you know, having this baby right now and I was like yeah and she was like do you want me to scrape your membranes and I was like uh, I don't know because I didn't know I didn't know much about getting my membranes scraped my mom said that I should too and then I know that this YouTube girl that I watched she got her scraped too and she ended up going to labor like the next day so she was like if you get your membrane scraped and you were like let's say you were gonna go into labor on Friday you'd probably go into labor like tonight or tomorrow so I was like well, that makes sense because I'm due tomorrow, so I was like, I might as well just go ahead and try to, you know. So I let her do it, and she, I don't know, I, everybody says that, like, certain things are painful, but they had nothing that, everything that people have said, like, to be painful, it hasn't been painful to me. Like, my mom was like, oh, when they check your cervix, it's going to hurt. And I was like, and they check my cervix all the time, and it doesn't hurt to me, it's just pressure. So... I don't know and I don't know how I feel about contractions because I don't I mean I have Braxton Hicks but I've never felt like a I guess a real contraction because if I felt a real contraction before then these are bearable because I don't really I mean I get pains and it's annoying but I don't really like take it to where like I'm like I need to go to the hospital because I am four centimeters dilated so my mom was like by now it's like certain people are already going to the hospital because they can't take the pain because they're that dilated and I was like oh well I guess I just kind of deal with the pain. But I, I'm wondering how he's going to react because all this stuff's so new to him. And you watch the video.
video in high school, right? Yeah, he watched the video in high school. I didn't I didn't tell him to watch another one because it's like just gonna freak him out. So I, he said he's gonna look down there. Some some guys they stand behind the mom and they just rub her head or something and they don't look down there. <laughs> but he said he's gonna look. Oh, he's no, like yeah, he said he's interested, so he's gonna look. And I was like, you can look down there. He's been my man since 2016. 15. Oh, 15. 16. 15. 16. No, 15. 15. 2015. So I've been with this guy for five years, so I don't care about him. So he's seen See, probably. <laughs> Yes, well, you it's your babe. I didn't say it. No, you said it. We'll see how everything goes. We'll see if I go into labor tonight or tomorrow. I'm really hoping that it's like, I don't really care if it's later tonight because I'll be going into my due date. And it'd be kind of, it'd be kind of cool if she came on her due date. Yeah, it'd be pretty awesome like, if it happened like at 11. Yeah. And like you like, had it like at 2.03. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. Maybe. I think I honestly think that she's gonna come really fast. Like I don't think that we're gonna be like waiting hours, no. like like 16 hours and stuff like that. Like I feel like it's gonna go super duper fast. I don't know, cause I mean I just like my mom told me that like people don't dilate that quick, and I, I'm already dilated to a four, and I'm still just walking around. But she said that also has something to do with me, the fact that I worked all the way up until I was about to be nine months. Like I would worked all the way up till a month ago so honey you could have sped up in front of him but like you could have the choice is his honey go like just go, go. <laughs> he literally is so scared to drive my car like so scared because i don't have those little safety things so he'd be freaking out no that's not what it is he's so scary but now we're finna go to target and pick up this stuff um, well, it's not stuff. It's just a lamp because I need a lamp by my bed so I don't have to when she's here I don't have to get up to turn on the light to like, you know, breastfeed her. I can just turn on the little lamp that's next to me. So we're at Target now. Um, I'm, gonna go first, to go. I'm on my way. I'm in a white SUV. Welcome to Target. We'll be out soon. Please wait in your car and keep the Sparco handy. I will and I shall. <laughs> Honey, what? <laughs> oh, there's no parking. My oh, bad. <laughs> this is why I like to drive. <laughs> it's literally you tell me what you cannot drive. Yes, ma'am. Right. Thank You're you. Okay. I appreciate it. Yeah, have a good one. You too. Okay. That's the lamp. <laughs> we drove up front lamp. That's a nice lamp. Mm -hmm. That's LED. LED. You know what I'm saying? It was only five bucks. It's a nice lamp. Okay, I looked so fat in the car because I couldn't like I couldn't like sit up. So I looked like I was like this. <laughs> it's okay. That's how I looked. And then my double chin is just atrocious and my neck is getting darker from being pregnant. But anyways. I'll show the flaws, girl. You good. Thanks, honey. Oh, we're just going to close it out right here. Um, because I'm sleepy. And we're about to find something to do. I don't know what. I should have recorded towards the light. Uh, uh, yeah, we're going to like uh, something to do. Yeah, I don't play. Well, son's kind of game. He wants to play a game, and then his sister wants to play a board game, and I'm like, y'all want to play all these games, and I want to lay down. <laughs> I'm so tired. Like, y'all don't understand. I'm still tired, and I slept, like, for how long? Mm -hmm. Long time. You slept twice. Yeah, I slept twice, and I'm still tired. Like, my body is so tired. And then, I don't know. I'm fe I feel queasy. So, we'll see what we're about to do. And... Yeah. So say bye, boo. Bye, boo. No, you're, they're not your boo. I'm your boo. Okay, <laughs> bye, guys. Bye. Next time you see us, we'll have Riley here. Say hey, babe.